Hi everybody! So this video is basically going to be an introduction for a new series that I'm going to be starting on my channel. And I'm super excited about this series. Basically the series is going to be where you guys are going to expect to see a video on my channel every, um, on a certain day, every single week. And this is kind of um, a way to give me a regular way to update you guys, because a lot of times I, I'm just doing random videos and I just kind of upload them whenever. But this is going to be something that you guys can expect, one of this type of video every week. And I know you guys already see my monthly standouts, which is something that I do on a monthly basis, but I wanted to do a video um, on a more, I guess, update, on a more, I don't know, I guess a more regular basis. So. This series, I know a lot of other gurus do series kind of matched with the day. Like I know Julie G, I think it's 713, does her Fashion Fridays. I know some gurus do Shout Out Saturdays or Shout Out Sundays. But I decided that I wanted to do a new series on my channel called Tuesday Tips. So basically what this means is that every Tuesday, expect to see a video. It can be anywhere from, you know, a 15-second video to a 5-minute video. I'm going to try to keep them shorter because it's kind of just like a quick tip to start out your Tuesday or to end your Tuesday as the case may be. And it's going to be just some sort of makeup or beauty-related tip that I've learned along the way that I want to share with you guys. Some of them will be pretty well-known tips that you guys have heard of, and some of them will be less lesser-known tips, I guess. So the first tip to kind of start off um, the Tuesday Tip series is going to be about tinted moisturizers. And tinted moisturizers are a fantastic thing to wear in the spring slash summertime because they're not quite as thick as a typical foundation, which is nice in the summer months when it's getting a little bit warmer. And they still provide your skin with the moisture, but they also have an SPF in them. At least most tinted moisturizers have an SPF. Both of these that I have here, this is a Clinique one and this is a Wet n Wild one, these both have an SPF of 15 in them. But some of you may not have a tinted moisturizer at home, or some of you may not want to invest in a tinted moisturizer. So you don't have to run out and buy one. You can make your own tinted moisturizer at home, and it's really easy. All you need is a foundation that you like and a moisturizer that you like. Now these are two things that most people have in their makeup collection already. So what you do is you just take, um, you know, one part foundation and one part tinted moisturizer, mix them together either on a palette. I like using the back of my hand. I just pour some out, and I use um, a makeup sponge to apply these, um, kind of one similar to this, and I just kind of mix it together and then apply it to my face. And this kind of makes like a homemade tinted moisturizer. Now, if you're looking for something with a little more coverage, you could do three parts foundation to one part moisturizer. Or if you want a little bit more moisturizer, you could do three parts moisturizer to one part foundation. So I really hope that this series is something that's kind of fun for you guys. I'm really excited to be able to share some of these tips with you. But um, let me know what you guys think of this idea, and I'll see you in my next video. Thanks, guys. Bye.